Noble late ladies and lords, is it your opinion that Sarah is worthy of elevation and to this our most noble order of the Pelican? Yeah! Sarah, no, that's where the medallion encapsulates the Pelican. Sarah, no, that's where the obligation of spirit will demand your efforts every moment of your life. A Pelican must be noble. Pelican's word must be the pinnacle of the soul beyond doubt, etc. They must never flee from the full face of overwhelming chaos, but instead must seek their peace. A pelican must give of themselves so that others may follow. A pelican must be aware of when their help is needed. Pelican must be loyal and fulfill most faithfully their duties to the barons and their sons. Their service must be an inspiration. They must be generous uh, and always and everywhere. Their actions must demonstrate the love of the kingdom and the people and their work and their duties. Now, Sarah, is it your wish we recognize the number of the order of Sarah. <coughs> Mindful of your service to society and responsive, responsive to the wishes of these your peers, we are resolved to create you a member of the most noble order of the world. This creature will nourish her young when necessary with the blood of her own breath. And therefore, as you chosen as the most appropriate symbol of service to society. Therefore, will you, Sarah, give us your words to Increase your labors nobly, increase your talents to support one of your stations, and seek to disseminate your talents and ability throughout the academy. Do you want us to think of the finish we can have for a few minutes? Is there a medallion? From our hands, your symbols of nobility and token of our esteem. Wear them proudly that all may recognize your service as we have acknowledged your consent. I thought somebody else could have Oh, yes, yeah. this is constellation. All right, the lineage of the ancient and honorable constellation medallion in the ancient days of the Middle Kingdom. It was gifted with the large brass pelican medallion whose origins are shrouded in mystery. Although this medallion was not given to the first pelican, it was first given to Duke Moonwolf and can trace its lineage through constellation pelican decreases. Mistress Philippola, out of her deep respect for Master Sigal, whom she passed the medallion to, had the ancient medallion blessed with the cathedral of the Immaculate Conception. The lineage as we have it. Moonwolf, Garrett. John, Takaya, Kirsten, Aaronwall, Sohala, Sigal, Kenna, Kaelin, Madalena, unfortunately was then lost to an age, but then returned to the hands of Maggie, Hadley, Fergus, and me, Odette, and now she reads it.
there a cap of maintenance? There is, Your Majesty. with Provident Council, which is to be observed for all time that Sarah Hassenkamp shall be declared, recognized, and elevated to be a companion of the Order of the Pelican, according to the modes and manners of custom and observed in the Society for Creative Anachronism and the Middle Kingdom. Also that there are many reasons for doing so. Among them, her generosity, courage, courtesy, humility, prowess, and franchise. She is, in fact, the very model of a modern Mid-Realm Pelican! <laughs> 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 This is not a scam. She knows the Dragon Herald and can quote the law Kapora fam and may map on lanes of Winged Hills in order like no other fan. She can tell the difference between a Facebook and a TikTok fan. She knows when someone's serious or if it's just a clickbait to add. She makes the promos for a bitch skill and care so don't get mad and shares with us pics of her cat so that we're never ever sad. She makes the promos for a bitch skill and care so don't get mad. And shares with us his other cat is sad. She keeps an even tongue and manner in all kinds of circumstance. She gives her time and resources and patience to all those who ask. And though she has anxiety, she's fearless when she must be The lives of those around her to make better their experience. Operations for pandemic parts ethereal, connecting royal with their subjects via paths all virtual. She teaches how to do that and about all creatures mythical and holds all sorts of offices, including drop dead Seneschal. Her colors black and gold, it comes in no surprise, she's Hufflepuff. And report that she is wise and smart and heckin' tough. She gives away a kind of garb so no one rocks round in the buff. We promise that this song will be completed here now soon enough. <laughs> think that she's amazing, so now here we set our hand and seal, seal in hand. And once again we tell you that we think that she is really grand. Before you hear our Sarah, an exemplar for our folks and land. So Runa and Art here do now make Sarah a new pelican. Before you hear our Sarah, an exemplar for our folks and land. So Runa and Art here do now make Sarah a new pelican. Hooray, we're almost done. <laughs> <laughs> and soon we'll cheer for our awarded friends and cry, Draco! Invectus! Another mid-round court now ends. Applaud for Grand Dame Sarah as forth on her journey she does when she is the very model of a modern mid-round pelican. <laughs> Applaud for Grand Dame Sarah as forth on her journey she does when she is the very model of a modern mid-round pelican. Okay. Thus we in our run up our and our grant to the presence that Sarah may without fraud enjoy the same privileges, franchises, immunities, and liberties with which all peers are now or shall hereafter be endowed. My God. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 